Hi guys, what is up and welcome back to another mob battle on the channel. Yes, we are back battling with more mobs because everybody loves it. And that is pretty much what this channel is about now. Just because everyone loves it. So I figure why the hell not? Let's keep doing it. Let's do more of it. You guys love it and love keep sending in your suggestions. I love reading your suggestions as well. So keep them coming guys. You're doing a phenomenal job as the per usual. And uh, yes, we have a super sick suggestion today as always. And today's suggestion is brought to us by Jordan McAdam. And he has recommended Chocolate Quest versus Fisher's Undead Rising mod. So that is what we are going to be doing today. I'm super stoked for this one. I'm super excited. It's going to be a sick mod battle or mob battle, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Jordan, thank you very much for your suggestion. And uh, guys, if you want your suggestions popped up on this video, beautiful looking board behind me make sure to subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell then slap that like button so you do not miss out on any super cool content on the channel and then once you've done all that good stuff comment down below and uh yeah we'll give you a shout out and uh, we'll do your battle as well and because i'm doing more battles throughout the week now i should get to your battle slightly quicker uh yes all righty let's do it we are in the arena we are ready to a fight. Let's put it to hard and let's do this thing. Mr. Sludge, I forget you've got to be done at night. I do. I, that, that does escape my mind sometimes. Okay, let's get out some night vision. Let's do it. Uh, Let's go for where's the eight minute mark. Uh, let's move that to there and let's have some of this bad boy stuff. Love it. Okay, so we can get rid of that now. Pop that down there. We can do some time settings. Uh, if I can just type it correctly. Okay, let's change it to that. Okay, boom. All good now. We are all good. Sludge Lord can get back up in here and not die. Alright, let's hit it. First mob we have from the Chocolate Quest, or Better Dungeons mod, whatever you want to call it. Uh, we have the Triton. And he's just gonna, he's gonna go straight in there. He is not gonna waste any time in the slightest. He is going full ham on these guys he's taking out the little sludgers and he's going for the big guy the big guy is wasting no time now he's dropping some mad sludge on this dude uh it seems fairly even sort of not really triton's dead nice well done lord of the sludge uh you got down to about 60 percent health so I'm worried what you're going to be like when we put you up against the Abyss Walker King later. Uh, I'm not sure how you're going to fare with that. But you are a super cool looking dude. I love that. Alright, here we go. He's back up in here. All healed up. Now we have a Minotaur. Uh, he has 30 HP. Not a mad amount. Whoa, bro. Give me that. Give me that back. Come on. Don't, don't, be, don't be doing this. Okay, let's hit him with that. And let's hit him with that. Right, Mr. Minotaur, are you going to battle or are you just going to get absolutely murked by little sludgers? He's getting attacked by the little sludgers. A little bit of lag, but it should be okay. Minotaur is not fighting back. I have no idea why. He was fighting the Triton earlier when I spawned him in. Uh, okay, dude has used his healing and there is no more left. Uh, Flippinek dude died very quickly. And that leaves the Sludge Lord A-OK. -okay. He, is, he is fine. He's loving his like, that's the best you've got. And he's spawned in loads of little sludges uh, in here as well to help him out. I love that. Alright, who do we have next? We have an Abyss Walker. Not the king, just a standard Abyss Walker. Okay, let's hit him with that. And let's hit him with that. Okay, that means the little sludges are going to go for the dude now. Okay, look at the little sludges go for him. They are protecting their big sludge lord. They are wasting no time at all. Uh, it looks like the sl uh, the Abyss Walker King is, or no, the Abyss Walker rather, struggling. And he's dead. He is straight up dead. Uh, okay, still at 70% health. Nice, nice. Okay, you're doing a bit better. 
What the hell? Why are they dying off? Do they die over time? I don't know. I don't know. But there seems to be quite a few of them. So, who, where do we have now? Okay. So, we are moving on to some of the more dangerous mobs now in the uh, Chocolate Quest Report mod. We are moving on to Shelob. The spider. Uh, let's do it. Okay. She's taken my mob battle stick. Uh, and uh, I'm going to hit this guy. Okay. They're going to go for it. Going to go for it. Yeah, boom, it's on, it's on like Donkey Kong. Shelob is struggling by the looks of things. She's not taking much damage from the uh, the Sludge Lord's uh, projectile attacks, but she is taking damage from the little sludges themselves. Oh, she has spawned in backup. Backup has arrived. How are you doing, Mr. Sludge Lord? Shelob is losing health. Sludge Lord is losing a lot of health. Uh, it's looking like a closer battle, this one. She lobbed down to 50%. Oh! She's only gone and done it. Damn. Nice one, she lobbed. So she went down to, what, 56% health out of 150? So a lot more than the Sludge Lord. Almost, well, pretty much over double. And her minions are stronger than the Sludge Lord's minions as well. So I'm going to say, Sludge Lord did pretty gosh damn well for that. Uh, nice effort, Mr. Lord of the Sludge. Uh, too bad, Shelob was just a bit too powerful for you. But, nevertheless, we move. And we move on to... Uh, what? Oh, do I have a... Oh, we got the Lich. Okay, I kind of want this guy to spawn in some backup and that's perfect timing because the doorbell has just rung and I'm back okay now let's get back into the flow of things so we've got a little lich up in here let's do it I say a little it's got 200 HP uh, definitely bro give oh, trade don't you I'll take this and uh, I'll hit you with that and then I'll hit you with this. There we go. Now we can get battling. Back to the battles at hand. Okay, so the little sludgers are going to do their little sludger things. And start attacking this dude. Uh, Sludge Lord, you should honestly just keep your distance, bro. Because quite frankly, you're not too good in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Uh, what is wrong with the Lich? Oh, we can see his face. Uh, okay, so why are you not attacking, which I'm finding extremely bizarre right now, to be perfectly honest with you, uh, because you're actually quite a powerful mob, uh, so what the hell are you playing at, bro? Uh, even the Sludge Lord is now throwing some projectile shizniz at this dude, I think he's killing his own men, to be perfectly honest, uh, I'm pretty sure he's killing his own people. Uh, well, there's sacrifices in war, I guess. And uh, this is a real turn of events because, honestly, I thought the Lich was going to murk this guy. Uh, I had money on the Lich just like, like two hitting him, to be perfectly honest with you. Because in the Better Dungeons mod, in the 1.7.10 version, dude is powerful. Dude is mad powerful. Uh, that healing they do have is OP as hell, though. Is ridiculously overpowered, the healing. Um, Alright, so let's see how, how much this guy keeps going. I want the Lich to fight back. This is a little disappointing for me uh, because I was expecting the Lich to, just to power through them. But my word, the Lich is taking a battering though. So if he heals one more time, I'm just going to take him out and just give it to the Sludge Lord. Because, yeah, I don't, I don't quite know what the Lich is doing. Being a bit of a being a bit of a numpty, uh, don't know what that was all about. How much night vision do I have left? Okay, I'm gonna need to get out some more. Uh, let's do it. Okay, we can swap that out for that, and let's have a smidge more. Boom shakalaka. Uh, back to full night vision. Uh, I'm not gonna despawn him. I want him to use his loads of little sludges on the Abyss Walker King. Okay, I'm gonna take out all these intruders though. They are uh, annoying. Um, okay, come on, let's take them out, let's take all these suckers down, okay, so let's do it, 
Uh, oh wait, no, one more. But don't you think you can run for me? Don't you think you can run for me? All right, let's do it now. Oh, where is he at? Boom! Abyss Walker King is in here. Uh, can I hit him? Yes, yes I can. There we go. Oh, the little sludgers are immediately getting one-hitted by the Abyss Walker King. He's just raining down lightning, thunder, fire, everything. The Sludge Lord is having a mare. Uh, barely being able to take this guy down any health at all. The little slob flipping heck. That is mad powerful. This guy does not stand a chance. I'm pretty sure he's like moments away from death. Yeah, I kind of figured that one. Uh, I probably didn't even need the extra night vision because that was extremely quick. Uh, the abyss walking just walked all over this guy. Pardon the pun. Well, there you go. I'm going to let you live. He went down 0.75 HP. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Okay, well, there you go, guys. Uh, Jordan McAdam, I really hope you enjoyed today's battle. It was your suggestion, mate, and it was a sick one at that. And uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Answer, your questions are answered. Walker King versus Sludge Lord. It's Walker King, mate. Always. Always Walker King. And uh, yeah, guys, remember, if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, hit that subscription and notification bell, like button, all that good jazz. Comment your suggestions down below as well. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Until next time, see ya.